Okay. I'm Sean. Speak up. I'm Sean. I'm Chantel. And what's your name, young man? <laughs> and these two are part of the dance that I recorded earlier. And they're going to tell, and I'm going to get closer now so everybody can hear you both. And kind of tell the people what the dance was, that it was a Kachina dance, obviously. We just got done with the Kachina dance. Um, yeah, I don't know really what it represents, though, but... Stage fright, huh? <laughs> What'd you say about the Supais? Because everybody, everybody well, Supais are Arizona they're, tribe. They're, they're, they're called... Yeah, I know that's okay. Keep going. That's fine. People like that. I don't. I don't really know how to explain it though. But aren't the Supais over on the Colorado River? Yeah. Yeah, that's right. And, and I got friends on Old Arabian. I know enough to know about it that when two different clans dance together, right? Yeah. The next time they dance, they incorporate each other's dances in their dances. And that's exactly what you've done. You've taken a supai dance and incorporated it into a kachina dance or a hopi dance. And then that's in this. Does that make sense? Yeah, it oh, it does. It makes total sense. Yeah. So, and these are a couple dancers, and I just had to be walking away. And uh, they look so damn good, and they're all dressed up. And why not get them on YouTube? So, uh, wave to the camera, folks, and I'll tell you how to find yourselves on YouTube. Okay. Uh, enjoy everybody out there. Uh, bye.